Hello, good evening. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Rinyankore, Learn Rinyankore by Mohozi Dennis Kafaras. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel to enjoy more lessons of Rinyankore. And this is a wonderful experience learning Rinyankore with you. You can go to Google Play Store, type in Mohoz Dennis. You enjoy the best apps that I have made. Or you can WhatsApp me with these numbers. Or you can email me. Or you can visit my blog, www.afritekinov.blogspot.com. And I'll be very, very grateful to welcome you. So, let's get going. So, today we are looking at Abanyabuzari. Anyway, let's look at what did we learn yesterday. Oh, yesterday we were looking at month of the year, Emiezi Yomaka. Oh, and one month is called Okwezi Komaka. Okwezi Komaka. So, we're going to Abanyabuzari, relatives. Relatives, and we have data. Can you employ a computer engineer? A computer engineer? Okay, Tata, Tata, Tata. This is Tata, this is Tata, and it means my father. If there are many, you say Vatata. This happens when you find you have many like batata muija, like assuming a group of fathers, so you call them batata. Then we have mama. Then you can call it mawe. Mama. My mother. That is mama. Or you can say mawe. Va mama, va mawe. You know what? In Kiswahili, we have a word called mawe. Mawe. Mawe means a stone. And it is no wonder that in Rinyankwari we have this word as mawe, which means the mother is the foundation stone of the family. That's how we call it mawe, meaning the mother is the foundation stone of the family in Ankori. That's why they call it Maui. But we normally say Mama. Va Mama. If there are many mothers. Va Maui. Then you have another word. Munyanyazi. Munyanyazi. You see? Munyanyazi. Munyanyazi means that uh, Mnyanyazi, that's my sister or my brother. Mnyanya. Mnyanyazi wanji. Mnyanyazi is mainly applicable to the boy, your brother. Then Mnyanya is a sister. You get it? So, Banyanyazi, I want to correct this because this one didn't make it well. So, Munyanya is strictly my sister. Hey, Munyanya. Okay, you can say, my brother stroke my sister. Munyanya. Okay, let's, let's do it like that. Munyanyazi. Munyanyazi meaning that is yours. So when you are referring that that is somebody's brother or sister, you say Munyanya. 
Mnyanyawe. Meaning, he belongs, his this brother or his, his sister. You get it? So, banyanya. You are meaning his or her sister or brothers. That is banyanya. Then you have mnyanyoko. You are saying you are your sister or your brother. Mnyanyoko. You get it? Mnyanyoko. If you somebody are saying your sister, Mnyanyoko, Aizra, you are meaning your sister came here. You get it? <laughs> and if there are many, Banyanyoko. We have Mnyanyako Yimwe. You are sister or brother. This is when like this is used when you are a father. You are a father and you are storing the children. That that is their sister. You could say Munyanyo Kwimwe. And it becomes Banyanyo Kwimwe, your brothers and sisters. We have Munyanya Zitwe. Itwe. Itwe, that is our eh, our sister or our brother. Banyanya Zitwe, that's our sisters or our brothers. And then we have <laughs> so join in for the class. You what do you mean? The class has gone. Sure. Let me start the meeting again. Wanga ku joining lesson yawa. Cause I sent the link and you couldn't. You couldn't join and saw the link expand. <laughs> the link expired. Oh, maybe data went. Should it be? Data went. Oh, network. Now, why don't I use data? Because I have data. But, uh... <coughs> okay. So we have. Mukuru Wanji. Mukuru Wanji, that is my elder brother or sister. Bakuru Wanji, that's my elder brothers or sisters. Then we have Murumna. Murumna Wanji. That is my younger brother or my younger sister. Then we have Varumna Wanji. Varumna Wanji. Avanyabuzari. Relatives. So we have Swento. Then we have Tatento. That is my paternal uncle. Suento. Suento. Oh, Suento. So, some people don't put H. They call it Suento or oh, Suento. But it means show ento. That means your, your young father. You get it? Batatento. Batata. Then ento. Meaning your young fathers. Ishento, aha, uh -huh. this is mainly Ishento. His or her 
patano anko ishentobu their patano anko nyakoromi my matano anko that's an anko who is born with your mother nyenarimi nyenarimi means is or her matano anko we have nyenarimibo their matano anko we have shwenkazi shwenkazi that is my patano aunt you get it if there are many va shwenkazi tatenkazi then we have ishenkazi his or her patano aunt bishenkazi <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> So we have Ishenkazbo. Hello. Hey. Hello. 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 Welcome. Mm -hmm. So, you know, she made it work queen G. Thank you. Yeah, but uh, school, yeah. school will be starting in uh, September. And what in September. First of September. We still in June? Yes. I'm saying like I was telling we we are in mm. Yes. Hello. Yes, Mr. Venice, I can hear you. And so, but uh, of course, the things I do are online. So, anytime, even if I have departed, we have finished our course, you will be asking me. And we we keep learning. Yes. Yes. Which classes did you take? Hungary. Uruguay? Hungary. Hungary. Yes. Uh, so they will give you a visa and everything so that you go and stay there? Yes. Wow, the big, the great <laughs> Thank you. So, how was your day? Is over your day, Sibarita? Yes, <laughs> So, it is over. Ntu kureva ahamazina gavanya busare relatives. 
relatives, mostly relatives. Yes. Okay. Uh, we shall look at the relatives and I will look at only the major ones. Uh, this starter, you already know that it means father, then mama. Yes. That's a mother. So okay. we have Munyanyazi. Mm. Munyanyazi, that is my brother. Munyanyazi. Eh, or my brother or my sister. Mm. Now, <laughs> some people, eh, you will hear them saying kanyanyas. <laughs> this kanyanyas is when you are still young. When you are still young, maybe the, your sister or brother is still young, so they tend to say kanyanyas, meaning small brother. Or smaller sister. Then we have Munyanya. Munyanya, that means his or her brother. Okay. Then we have. Munyanyoko. Munyanyoko. Munyanyoko means your sister or your brother. Your. That is if you are telling a person that you are brother. That is your sister or your brother. Then we have a Munyanyoko. Munyanyoko. That is if you are telling a person that your brother. Then we have, if you are telling our brother, eh, our brother or our sister is Munyanya Zitwe. Munyanya Zitwe. That means our brother or our sister. Then we have Mukuru Wanje. Mukuru Wanje. Mukuru Wanje. That means elder brother or sister. Mukuru Wanje is elder brother or sister. Then we have Murumuna Wanje. Murumuna, that is younger. Yes, Murumuna. Murumu Nawanje, that is my young brother. Mm. <laughs> it is funny. Okay. Hey, Murumu Nawanje. Mm. And Mukuru Wanje. So, oh, you never room never away. Eh. <laughs> yes. hey. Then we have, we're going to go to Swento. Swento, that is your paternal uncle. Some people call it Swento or some call it like this. Swento. That is my paternal uncle. The uncle from your father's side. Then we have... On the father's side. Um, yes. Ishento, that is... His or her paternal uncle. 
if you ever go to a family where they are they are marrying it is like a marriage you hear them say ishento arinkahi that means his or her uncle then we have matano uncle is called nyakoromi It's called Nyakoroni. That means the uncle from your mother's side. But the, me, I've never called my uncle that one. <laughs> I always call my uncle. I always use the the English term of calling him uncle. Yeah. Yeah. So our uncle is from the mother's side. For us, this word is so difficult to us. We offered to call them uncle. <laughs> so this one is for those who have... Uh, the, but in case you hear somebody saying in your koromi, you mean, you know his meaning, his maternal uncle. Mm. Mm. Then Ninarimi, that is his or her maternal uncle, if you are parent to another person. Ninarimi. Then we have Shwenkazi. Shwenkazi, that is the paternal aunt. This one we used to call her Shwenkazi. That one is even in Uganda, they have Shwenkazi. <laughs> then I about it. Yes. Shwenkazi, that is paternal uncle. Then if you are referring to somebody's auntie, you say Ishenkazi. Eh, then the maternal aunt is called the Nyakwento. Nyakwento. <laughs> it's called the Nyakwento. Do you know this word Nyakwento comes? See? This Nyakwento comes from Nyoko. Nyoko Omuto. You know, your maternal aunt is like your young mother. Yes. So that's why they called it, they chose to call it Nyakwento. That is your young mother. Hello. That is Nyoko Omuto, which is Nyakwento. Then Nyinento. If you are referring to somebody's Matano aunt. Hello. Then you have Nyinento. There. Then we have the word show. Your father. If you are show are in Kahi. <laughs> that means where is your father? Show Arinkahi. Show Arinkahi. Show Arinkahi. Hello. Minister of Education. Hello. Yes. <laughs> now, we were here on Shwenkazi. Tukwe. Sure. Eh, Tatuya Shwenkazi. 
Then I had told you about Nyakwento. Nyakwento means it comes from the word Nyoko Ento. That means your young mother. O Mawe Ento. Mawe means mother. Sikwe. So Mawe Ento. That means young mother. That is your aunt. Then we have show. Show means your father. Yes. Show is your father. If I say show arinkahi, I'm meaning where, I, where is your father? Show arinkahi. That is in case I'm not related to your father. Maybe I'm your friend. I'm, I'm just your father's friend. Then I come and say, show Arinkahi. <laughs> then we have Ishe. Ishe. Is or oh, her father. Ishe. Uh, that is somebody's father. His or oh, her father. You can call him. Ishe, that is his or her father. Then we have Tatitwe. Tatitwe means Tatitwe means our father. Tatitwe is our father. Uh, our father. Then we have Shwimwe, your father. Okay. Vasho itwe. Yeah, it be Yeah, so we have. Mawitwe, our mother. Mm -hmm. Then we have Nyoko. So this word Nyoko and show. Mawitwe. Eh, Mawitwe, that is our mother. Because itwe means. Itwe means our. Then we have Nyoko, that is your mother. Though this word nyoko is always like it is always rude, it is not polite. You get it? It is not polite. If you are referring to somebody's mother, yeah, you say mama wawe. <laughs> Uh, but when you say nyoko, that means you are you are not polite, like so it, it is better you say mama wawe. Mama wawe inkahi. Where is your mother? There you are being polite. Then we have nyena. Nyena means his or her mother. Nyena. Eh, Nina. Then we have Ninabo. Ninabo means their mother. Ninabo. Bo, this bo means their Ninabo. Ninabo, their mother. Then we have Tatenkuru or Ishenkuru. Or sometimes we call it Shwenkuru. Shwenkuru means like your old father. Hmm? Shwenkuru, that is grandfather. Eh, 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 eh,
Ishenguru. That is grandfather. But me, I always call mine Shwenguru. Okay. Then we have Mawenguru Itwe. That is our grandmother. Because I've not told you what grandmother means. Grandmother, we say Nya Nyakwenguru. Nyakwenguru. Oh, Mawenguru. Let's call it Mawenguru. So, what? This thing is not that I'm doing. Delete. Mawenguru. That means Mawe is mother. Then Nkuru means old mother. That is grandmother. Mawenguru. Mm -hmm. And some people call it it can be nyokwenguru. If I put nyokwenguru like this, this thing is refusing to. So you either say nyo, nyo, nyokwenguru, but nyokwenguru is the best one instead of nyokwenguru. So it is nyokwenguru. So, Nyakwenguri means your grandmother. Hello. Then we have Mazara. Mazara. That is it. Mazara means mother in law and tata zara that is father in law mazara mazara itwe our mother in law tata zara itwe our father in law. Mm-hmm. That is our father-in-law. Then we have Nyokozara. Nyokozara means your mother-in-law. Nyokozara imwe. Your mother-in-law. Then we have Tatazara. Tatazara means my father in law. Then Computer science. So 
So, hello. I think now, let me continue. Then I'm going to stop the lesson. So we have Nyenem Guru, his or her grandmother. Tatazara, this is father in law. Then we have Nyenem Guru, his or her grandmother. Then we have Ishen Guru. Ishen Kuru, that is his or her grandmother. Then we have Mwishkuru. Mwishkuru means a grandchild. If they are many, they are Avishkuru. Avishkuru. It is Avishkuru. Mm hmm Staff sergeant. Then that war one. Where an officer doctor? Then we have Mramu. Mramu means Mramu is brother or sister in law. Within our own, our very own, he he he, including our very own ASP. We have Omramu, his or her sister in law. Yes, so if I'm saying about my wife, I have a wife, so if I'm talking about the wife's brother, I say Mramu. Why say some people call it Mura, but I always say Mura, Mramu. <laughs> yeah. Mura. Could delay even my girl second to accept to deliver. I couldn't. <laughs> and I could delay. <laughs> oh, it is wrong spelling. Then we have Omram, his or her sister in law. Omhara, his or her daughter. Mhara, Mhara Wanji. There you remove the O. Mutavan Wanji. Mutavani, that means son of Omukwe, son Inro, Omukamana, daughter Inro. Yeah, daughter Inro. That's Omukamana. Then we have Muka, that is wife of. So I think we are stopping from here. I have to get going and